This is a question that's been coming up more and more. I've seen it written in many different articles. I've seen it on different postings, comments, different videos on, on YouTube and other mediums. The question of our teachers now becoming obsolete, now that we have so much advancements from OpenAI, ChatGPT, from Google Gemini, uh, from Copilot, all these different AIs are gaining these capabilities are being able to have vision, audio, all these different things. Now the question arises of, is, is, does this mean that teachers are obsolete? We don't even need teachers anymore? So I'm here to say that no, that, that isn't the case. We still very much need good teachers. But you heard what I just said there, right? I said good teachers. So that's a big difference. Um, it made me think about some of the writing that I've done in the past about this topic. Uh, one book that I wrote quite a while ago here, and it was an ebook, and it talked about top seven characteristics of a, a real excellent instructor and what that meant. So if we look at that, we see that, yes, the AI is gaining some of these aspects, but not in a full human way, not in a full encapsulating uh, presentation. So although it might start to excel in some of these different things, it's, it's a bit more communicative, it's a bit more uh, motivational, somewhat engaging, it still doesn't put everything together. Now, it's great, and I think it will serve as a great uh, tutor, a great enhancement tool, and definitely a powerful tool that instructors can use, because we can be so much more capable by using this tool, by working together with this tool. But good teachers will always be needed. I want, you, I want to read something that I wrote in the very first book that I, I made dealing with AI. So this book was, uh, was, came out in 2022, so uh, very early on. And this is my uh, chat GPT AI in education. So this is one of, the, one of the first books I wrote about AI. And I want to read about this very specific topic. Given that we have already been in the information age since the late 1970s, educators should not be viewed as the gatekeepers of knowledge, but as subject matter experts, experts in a given subject matter that guide students in understanding by building relationships, creating emotional connections to the instructional material, developing communities of inquiry, elaborating, discussing, maximizing engagement, motivating, providing opportunities to practice and apply skills, assessing in a developmental way, providing ongoing assistive feedback, and then assessing in a summative way. If teachers or professors' classrooms do not look that way, then yes, they will be open to being completely overtaken by AI tools such as ChatGPT sooner rather than later. So that's a powerful thing right there in that yeah, guess what? Your job may very much be open to being taken over by an AI if you're not this high-level instructor. If all you do is come in and give a lecture and then leave, well, guess what? Even before AI, that, that type of teacher should have been replaced by simply having a video. If we don't have engagement within the classroom, if we don't offer these opportunities for discussion, for for real reflection, for real engagement, for hands-on learning, then yeah, we can just use an AI or we can just use video. We have to really think about what is it that we bring to the table? What is it that really makes us worthwhile and really relevant? That's a key aspect there. Why do we need to have an instructor there? What more does it give to the student for the overall educational experience? I'd like to share one more thing from one of my more recent books, right? This one, The AI Literacy Imperative, and that this sort of brings it more to a, a, a culmination here. More than ever, those serving in a teaching role need to bring more than just subject knowledge to the classroom. They need to be approachable, motivational, enthusiastic, have great pedagogical skills, create a safe, secure, fair learning environment with a great instructional presence and be able to create multiple authentic learning situations where students can meaningfully use and display their newly learned skills and capabilities. Instructors need to maximize that which makes them more valuable than an AI, their humanity. By having great emotional intelligence, 
being able to truly know each student and working to help students create a strong emotional connection with the class subjects, teachers will always provide a priceless cornerstone to the learning process. Again, uh, I'm very much in favor of, of AI, but I see it as an important tool that teachers can use to enhance their capabilities. But again, we have to maximize our capabilities, those human aspects, making the class a real engagement uh, filled atmosphere, really creating emotional connection with the content. It's one thing to be able to talk to the AI, to give us a, a speech, to have it recognize and understand and give you feedback. That's great, but it's not quite the same as standing in front of your entire class and having to give a presentation of having this anxiety of what are they gonna ask me? Cause there's gonna be a Q and A session afterwards, right? Well, those are very important skills. Those are power skills, soft skills that we also need to develop within our students. So yes, there can be great book knowledge that comes from interacting with an AI. And I think we'll be able to do that more and more as the capabilities increase. Uh, AI will be an awesome, awesome tool for simulation so that we can practice, we can have emotional connection in that way but we still need to maximize the social learning that occurs within the classroom. And that comes from having good teachers. And that will be extremely difficult to replace. Maybe maybe in the distant future when we have robots that look and act exactly like humans, but that's quite a ways off. But we have to ensure that we are always working on ourselves. We have to show the world that our humanity, all these different aspects, the motivation, the enthusiasm, the interaction, knowing the students, the engagement, creating this atmosphere, safe, secure environment in the classroom, that still takes good teachers. So yes, good teachers will always be needed and we can definitely work to enhance our capabilities by working with the AI. So it's this aspect of working together. There shouldn't be this dichotomy of, oh, we're gonna have an AI teacher instead of a, a, a human teacher. No, it's about bringing it together so that we can be much more and we can create this awesome learning environment for everyone involved. Thank you, and remember, learning is for life. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you got uh, some good benefit from it, please like, share, subscribe, and please comment. I love having discussions within the comments. I will respond to each one, and that way we can have our own community of inquiry, and we can increase our capabilities and learn from one another. Thanks a lot.